A whole lot of runners passed me by today as I cheered them on from the sidelines. In total, 16,000 people from 46 different states and seven different countries participated in the big day. At the sound of a horn, thousands of runners and walkers started the journey over the Bay Bridge, each with their own reason for taking on the 10K. For the fun of it. For me, it's supporting my local community. Um, I live a half a mile from the finish line, and so it's really exciting to see all of these people come to Stevensville. And with each step, they kept the end goal in mind. Finishing <laughs> and getting in the hot tub. <laughs> no, yes. the view. I yes. do want to see the view. The race kicked off at the Northrop Grumman campus in Anne Arundel County and finished on Kent Island. The goal is to build community and embrace the beauty of the bridge. It really showcases the gem of Maryland, the Chesapeake Bay, highlights the Bay Bridge, of course, but it really brings the community together. The bridge is usually closed to pedestrians. As the top runners crossed the finish line, they told us they took in every second of the scenery on foot. It's actually a lot less scary running and walking over it. You get to take it in a little bit more when you're running across it than when you're, uh, than when you're driving and just feeling, feeling the air and nature. It's awesome. I'm Brianna Ross, WBAL TV 11 News. And organizers say the run generated somewhere between five and seven million dollars for Anne Arundel County and Queen Anne's County.